The non-commissioned officer appearing in many of the mechanical assembly scenes is Staff Sergeant Louis Fiore, Section Chief of the Servicing Section. Sergeant Fiore and his crew are now attaching the rotating frame assembly, known as the tilt ring, to the bottom of the four fins of the thrust unit. The tilt ring is attached to the bottom of the missile with four large locking collars. The locking collars connect to lugs mounted on the bottom of each fin. Servicing section personnel are now hoisting the thrust unit out of its transport trailer so that it can be mated with the missile body. The thrust unit is now suspended by the A-frame rigging. And here we see the thrust unit trailer being driven out from under the thrust unit. Note the number of men standing on the tilt ring. They were required to keep the thrust unit in perfect balance while the trailer was being driven out from underneath the thrust unit. In this scene, we see sitting on its side one of the four steering rudders which will be attached to one of the four thrust unit fins. The missile body is now being backed down to the launcher area for mating with the thrust unit. In this view, note the man who hops up into the skirt section of the missile body. His tasks will include mating the electrical connectors and the high pressure air lines once the missile body and the thrust unit are mated. He also assists in aligning the two missile sections. The bulkhead viewed here at the end of the thrust unit is the top of the alcohol fuel tank. The two units are aligned for mating with the use of six ball and socket guide pins. The long rectangular box seen on the side of the thrust unit houses one of the two air pistons used to separate the missile in flight. On block two missiles, the two air pistons were mounted internally in the thrust unit. The two units will now be secured together with the use of six explosive bolts threaded through the six guide pins. The nose of the completed missile now rests on the warhead trailer. With missile assembly completed, the tilt ring will now be attached to its two pivot points on the launcher.
The servicing section is now attaching the high pressure airlines valve box to the tilt ring. The firing section is now making electrical connections to a tilt ring junction box. This J box was not used on Block 2 missiles.